it's at the Coney's uh, booth and uh, had have a privilege to uh, to meet with uh, Juan and uh, well, please give us a brief of what you've done with right. this film. So I'm Juan Ovaya. Um I make with myself, uh, my company name is Arabis Acoustics and um, yeah so basically this has been a two or three year long project out of my university dorm basically to make probably the best uh, dynamic headphones that I can come up with and given the resources that I have. So this this headphone achieves pretty much flat to 20 hertz frequency response plus or minus a couple dB and it is extended to 20 hertz as flat as can be for this type of headphone. Um, a lot of work is done with the acoustics and I've used pads from the Kony Audio here. Ah, okay, so to, that's the partnership with yeah, the Kony. To optimize the response as much as I possibly can to have a neutral but at the same time fun and enjoyable relaxing sound to it Yeah. while still keeping some of that detail past the killer and all that. So these are in production right now. I'm, you know, the rollout is slow because of supply constraints due to COVID, but uh, this is available on artofacoustics.com. And, uh, what's the what's the website? You can send me the the, the link. I can okay. There's a QR per code oh, here. perfect, <laughs> perfect. So right. scan it later. Yeah. But, um, yeah. So uh -huh. um, So these these will be retailing at six hundred and eighty five dollars uh, here, here in the U S. And yeah, please give it a try. Yeah. Thanks. Uh, is it open back? Uh, yeah. So this is an open back fifty millimeter dynamic driver. Dynamic driver. Okay. Yeah. So, and there's some modifi electroacoustic modifications to the driver to achieve maximum extension possible. Right. So, Which uh, headphone amps are you recommending for this? I mean, uh, is it so, hard to drive or? So this is a 20 ohm headphone because of, uh, because of how the electronics work. Um, it does require some more current to drive. Uh, solid state amps are recommended. Uh, two, uh, OTL tube amps, not so much because this does drive a little bit like a plan R. Uh, but some people say it sounds good, and it does notice. You know, the two bands do notice me smooth out the sound if you're into that. Uh, however, personally, I like to listen to this in solid state amplifiers like the iFi models and things like that. And whatnot. So, got it. All right. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be interesting to try it out. I'm gonna try it out now. The boy yeah. is gonna try it out too. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. Oh, one more thing. Yeah. Um, Odyssey does the best. Uh, Odyssey supplies the headbands here, so these are original SP2 bands. All right, all right. Okay. So, yeah. Anyways, yeah, please right. give it a try. Yeah. Tell me what you think. Cool. I like the industrial look. All right, we're going to come back.